and they have to, you know, be certain that this person is actually going to go over that spike strip. And that officer, obviously, after the they, after they throw that spike strip, right. they have to right. get out of the way. They have to actually hide, if you will, so that they don't see that officer um, as well before they hit it. But we're, we're it's hearing unclear. Now, yeah. mm -hmm. We're hearing now uh, from our desk here that they did have a good spike. Mm. Uh, so we're hearing that authorities do believe they may have uh, had some punctured uh, tire on this. So if that's the case, it's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And as you say, you know, it is really a dangerous situation when they're putting strips on a, a wide open highway. There's no way to control where this person is driving or where anyone else is. And, oh, and out. Did they run out of Here gas? We go. And running. Here we go, running. Running. Uh, Okay, no, they, they realize it's over. It, it looked like looked like they wanted to run, mm -hmm. thought better of it. Off the 210 at Lowell, realized that uh, it was just a matter of time because the spikes were were effective there. The tires were deflating, mm -hmm. and I they've just the riding was on the wall for this suspect. And just like that, it is over here off of the uh, 210 freeway. Looked like they were going to try to run. Saw there was nowhere to go. CHP was ready for it. You saw that they give the suspect no space whatsoever, mm -hmm. and uh, now they are preparing to uh, take this person into custody.